Hi, I'm Moran Sandhouse, Marketing Director of the Wireless Connectivity Business at Texas Instruments. I'm excited to introduce the industry's first single chip solution to integrate all in one GPS, wireless LAN 802.11n, FM Receive, FM Transmit, and Bluetooth, including the latest Bluetooth Low Energy specification. With the integration of these connectivity technologies, TI continues to reduce size, power, and cost allowing device manufacturers to extend these technologies into lower tier markets and to more consumers. Here you can see the Wiling 7 1283 chip itself. It's 50% smaller compared to existing two-chip solutions in the market. This small footprint will help manufacturers continue to deliver slim, sleek devices to the market. In addition, one of the key combo advantages is improved coexistence. Coexistence is always an issue for manufacturers due to the interference and overlapping spectrum. Since all the cores are on the same chip, we've implemented unique mechanisms to cancel out board and chip level RF interference and ensure simultaneous operation with benchmark performance. For example, based on Wiling 7, a user can play an internet game over 802.11n, stream to television while routing audio to Bluetooth headset, and using a gaming controller communicating over Bluetooth low energy. On device level, Wiling 7 does micro-scheduling to ensure seamless operation over a shared antenna. Let's take a look at this new technology in action. This Wiling 7 device connected to an OMAP 3430 Zoom 2 platform running an Android operating system. The device operates all connectivity cores in parallel. This is the 802.11n 2.4 GHz antenna shared between Wi-Fi and Bluetooth. This is the 5 GHz 802.11n antenna. This is the GPS receiver plugged to the GPS simulator. And this is the FM antenna over which we receive the FM signal. FM radio is transmitted from another solution. FM radio is received to these stereo speakers. The GPS receiver is locked on our position and is constantly tracking satellites. In parallel, we can stream YouTube over 802.11n from the internet. The audio is routed over Bluetooth A2DP to these stereo speakers. Although wireless LAN and Bluetooth share the same spectrum, our coexistence solution works around it. The Wiling 7 solution is sampling to customers today and is expected to be included in devices in mass production by the end of 2010. With the addition of Wiling 7 to our product portfolio, TI is spearheading the next generation of combo devices. For more information, please visit ti.com slash Wiling 7. <laughs>